Yo, what is up, everybody? It's Cobra here, bringing you another commentary. And uh, here we go. This is a MW3 gameplay on interchange with the um, different snipers. <laughs> I'm using the L18, the Barrett, and the MSR, I believe, all in the same game. Uh, I'm just trying to switch it up. Um, this is my first game on, and I just got this gameplay. So, um, yeah, just. Be aware of that before you come to any conclusions that I suck. Because I will miss a few point blank range shots in this game, so yeah. Alright, so anyways, um some some information I wanted to talk about in this video. Like I said the last video was the Ravenous G dual Taj. Alright, so me and him are um you know we're we're really good friends and uh we're we're uh I don't know, we just thought of doing a dual tage like one day I was just like you know after constrict you want to uh, you know, do a dual tage you know like I don't know um, you know so we just decided to do a dual tage and we decided to make it multi cod because um, you know he's an absolute monster at cod 4 and you know and the b3 is kind of my specialty and so is mw2 and uh, you know it's it's fun because we play whatever we want. We get clips. We get like the clips we want. We we don't. We're, this this montage. We're not really gonna care about standards. We'll we'll put in the nice shots, the nice clean shots, and um, yeah. So I think it'll be really sick. I think we're planning to make it somewhere around 10 minutes long. So um, it's it's gonna be pretty dirty. But uh, first, I need to finish constrict. <laughs> Uh, which will be a badass montage, I will assure you that. Um, but yeah, um, it's gonna be really sick seeing our dual touch because, you know, we're both, I think, in our, my opinion, we're both kind of underrated. Um, and yeah, so that's the information I wanted to talk about for the dual touch. Now, what I, what I also want to talk about is that Kony 2012 stuff. Now, if you didn't know, Joseph Kony is um, a guy in Uganda that's uh, you know pretty much just cutting. He's just he's just abducting kids, um, using them as sex slaves or using them as freaking army soldiers. And uh, what he'll do is he'll give people he'll give these little kids guns and make them kill their families, or they'll and for punishment. He'll make them cut their lip, or he'll cut their lips and their nose off, or something like that. Now, everybody's heard of that, I think, by now. I mean, there's been a million view, like million videos on it, and um, you know, everywhere you go now in the comment section, it says Coney through 2012. Now, I don't really see it as a big problem. Like, I mean, I do, but like, I don't. Like, I think we, if we really wanted to, we could just go in there and take his ass out. But, um, yeah, I don't know, dude, like, it just, I mean, we, we can, but they don't want to get, they don't want to get into it, and, you know, I don't really see why, I mean, you, we might want to just take them out, I mean, although there is other criminals we need to worry about at the same time, we do need to worry about this guy, I mean, he's abducting children and freaking cutting their lips and nose off and shit, I mean, god, it's so terrible, but, you know, I don't know, man. Just, I'm not going to be ignorant about it anymore, so I'm not going to say anything else because I feel like I don't know my facts. <laughs> so, I mean, like, I heard that 70% goes to them and 30% goes to the um, actual charity, which, I mean, I think it's understandable. I mean, that's a pretty, actually, it's a reasonable ratio because uh, if you look at any other charity, that's about the same. Um... But really, what really surprised me is how I heard, I don't know if this is true, but I heard that some of the 70% is going to the Ugandan government and the, um, and the Ugandan military. So, I don't even know, dude. Like, is that helping them out? <laughs> you know, but, uh, I don't know. Now I'm gonna stop talking. So, anyways, this, um, this game on W3, I'm actually playing a lot more now. I used to be just playing MW2, and so that's why I haven't really gotten a ton of clips. I probably, if I played MW2, 
I mean, if I didn't play MW2 during the time that I could be playing MW3, I think I'd have like 70 clips right now, um, waiting to go for Constrict, but, but instead I only have about 30 something, so, yeah, um, they're all really sick clips though, and I can't wait, um, but I'm gonna try for that TES recruitment challenge, so I heard that, um, from the Asylum and that, and, uh, Snipeinator, that there will be a TES recruitment challenge, uh, very soon, and I'm just gonna go for that one and not for the Grizz one, because the Grizz one, obviously, I don't really think I'm gonna get into, <laughs> so I just, I kinda gave up, and, you know, I'm not gonna be able to hit, hit five clips today, the deadline's like tomorrow or something, so, um, I'm just gonna start fresh, TES recruitment challenge pretty soon, um, if not, I'll just try to show them my videos and what I can produce. Um, I gotta get more active on here though. I mean, what do you guys want to see from me? You want to see clips? Or do you want to see funnies and fails? Do you want to see common series? I mean, obviously montages. I'm gonna work on those. Um, I'm gonna after constrict and after the G dual touch. I'm gonna work on some Venom episodes again. I'm gonna start that back up. Um, and um, you know, what do you guys want to see exactly? Um, I'm not really sure. Uh, so just leave in the comments below and also leave a like um, Please cuz uh, you know, I don't really care about my subscribers like the amount of subscribers I care about the quality of subscribers so um, If you guys can help me out because I have about like eight active subscribers right now and um, I'd, I'd like to get back to where I was like where I was at inception and, you know, back in the day when I was actually a little bit more active. So, you know, um, we'll see what happens. Um, I'm, de I'm actually going to start up a Funnies and Fails. So, I hope you guys like it. Um, it's going to be pretty sick. And uh, it's going to be pretty funny. So, um, yeah. Uh, there's really nothing... Uh, there's really nothing to talk about from this point on. Because I don't really have any information uh, about anything else. So, I'm just going to end the commentary right here, <laughs> and, um, yeah, so, before I do, though, um, sniping, uh, I actually tried in Black Ops again, and my shot was horrific, I mean, like, going to, from NW3 to Black Ops, sniping is just ridiculously hard, I don't even know how people just go back to it and just wreck, I mean, I tried just warming up in combat training and stuff, but still, even then, my shot wasn't completely on like it was. So, um, but I'll definitely put some Black Ops clips in that multi dual Taj, Ravenous Jeed, and we'll see what happens from there. Um, but yeah, that's all I wanted to talk about in this commentary. You know, thanks so much for listening. Thanks so much for being active, guys. And I promise I won't let you guys down. Um, so yeah, later, guys. Oh, one more thing, I'm going to speed up the gameplay right here real quick, and I'm going to put my friend's dual Taj promo at the end of this, and uh, leave a link in the description, because, uh, yeah, he's my really good friend, so, yeah, just check it out.